I'm already started. Are you going to shut that door or you want me to leave it open? Okay. Yeah, it's not broadcasting, but you can't be seen. You're, my head's in your way. Well, it looks like uh, we have one person in here, maybe. I don't know. Let's see here. It looks like everything's going good. All right. Yes. Do have a haircut. Just got the haircut today. I'm in HD's in here, it looks like. Uh, thank you guys for being in here early. Uh, sorry, it was a little late. I was trying to get uh, some other stuff fixed up. I was going to try some different. Um, I was going to try something different. With the camera angle wasn't working out. Uh, but um, Lime HD said hi. I don't know if she heard me, but I'm sure we'll see her later. Um, so. Yeah, so today's going to be kind of an interesting live stream. We're going to do something a little different. Um, if you guys have been on my Discord, uh, you would have seen that we got this. Okay. We got the limited edition UA flag visor on our flag visor. Uh, so, like, I haven't told many about this. So, I picked this up from Ross, okay, and Ross is $16.99, like, I just, like, show up to, to Ross, didn't, never have found anything like this at, like, a Ross or a TJ Maxx or anything, and I picked this up, and I was just like, this is awesome, we have to get out of here with this, so I picked it up, and uh, so, yeah, we got a uh, flag visor now. So we'll be unboxing this today and showing you exactly what it looks like. And I will post a, an official video on this uh, because we will be giving this away at the end of the month. Go ahead and set your calendars for June 30th. It'll be the last day of, of the month. 15 days from now, uh, we'll start the live stream. And so uh, there will be a video for this, um, for this visor. We'll unbox it. Uh, and then, you know, we'll show it what it looks like. But today I thought about, you know, why don't we just go ahead and put it uh, on a, on its, um, we'll go ahead and put it on the, um, on a helmet. Karan Johnson's in here, Lime HD, uh, 1K Kings says your videos are really cool. Thank you. Thanks, man. Uh, and then Anthony's in here uh, as well, and several other viewers. So thank you guys for being in here today. Um, I just want to go ahead and say um, we have surpassed a few milestones since we've uh, started last week. Uh, last week, we um, I believe Anthony's in here right now, but he was able to be our very first patron. So go ahead and thank Anthony for being our first uh, Patreon subscriber. You guys can also support Patreon <clears throat> as well by checking out my Patreon page uh, down below. If you'll go to the uh, link in the description, you'll be able to see my Patreon page and be able to see all the fun stuff that's on there. Uh, if you guys don't want to click on the link and stay on with me, uh, we can I can show you a quick little screen share of it. Um, basically, uh, we're sitting right now at $45. Um, we need to reach $30 more dollars uh, so all current patrons uh, can get a free Mr. Football wristband. Uh, so that at this at this moment, we would only have one patron, but there are other things. Like I've got, if you just donate $1, uh, there are some vlogs you can have uh, exclusive access uh, or anything like that. And then some of the subscription boxes have went down in price. Uh, specifically, the basic box was just $25 a month, and the premium is now $50, okay? and that's what Anthony got. So I uh, just wanted to give you a quick little shout-out on um, on Patreon and just show you what we're working on. So that will be, uh, be our first milestone. If we get to $50, we'll have uh, like a special giveaway for that as well. Um, so uh, thank you. Thank you for all of your support anyway. Um, so, yeah, I appreciate all the support. 
uh, that everybody gives, even if you can't donate anything, and that's that's perfectly fine. Um, and, I, and I really think, and, and see, and the thing about the subscription boxes is, um, you know, I, I get a video game subscription box, and I think I've told you guys this before, but you know, it it kind of takes some money out, you know, to do it. But it, I like to play old video games, so it's kind of cool to just go back and play that. Uh, all the games that I get, and I'm sure it's cool for Anthony. He'll his box will be shipped here in five days. Uh, so it could be expecting that by the end of the month, at least, um, you'll have your box will be coming in. I'll kind of let you know when it ships at least. Um, but yeah, uh, we're going to take a look at the flag visor. Um, I haven't actually done an official video on this or anything. So we'll actually probably box it back up and then, and then take it all out of the box again. But, um, I mean, I just wanted to show this. So Got our stickers, of course. <clears throat> it comes with all the standard stickers. Um, black Under Armour Clips. So here's the visor. Um, and, it, and it's crazy to look through because when you wear it, you can't really see the flag. So if y'all ever had like questions like that, like you can't really see it. But it just looks amazing. So uh, you can't see your eyes, so it's not going to be a legal visor. Um, it'd be, it's going to just look good on a, on a helmet. Um, but yeah, let you guys kind of look through it and see what it looks like. There you go. It looks different. I know there's a glare on it, but um, just as you can kind of see, you can sort of see the outline of it, but when you look at it, if when you look at it normally, you can't see them because of the visors right here. You can't really see those designs, but really cool visor. Um, because I mean, basically, I don't know. If, I don't. I don't know how my other visors compare against this one. I kind of want to look at different ones that I've got and see <clears throat> just how dark this is. <clears throat> Excuse me. So here's the helmet that we're going to be putting on today. We've got a. Uh, Rebel Speed helmet. We'll be attaching it uh, here soon. Uh, so we'll be putting that on. Uh, it'll be actually this this face mask here. The it's the S2 EG2, I believe. Um, S2BD EG, I believe two visor it's the version two of this but we'll be putting that on here soon um <clears throat> is there bm golden goblin says is there a way i can see how long i've been subscribed to you for you um the only way that i know how is to like look at my total list of subscribers and to see like because i can see like most recent <clears throat> let's see i can probably I can probably look real quick. I don't know if I'll be able to find you exactly. Anthony says, just got done fitting my Sisu mouth guard. I've not ever tried one of the Sisu mouth guards, but I think that's going to be something I'm going to try to look into. Um, we'll kind of see how that goes. Let's see. Da, 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 da. See, I can see certain... You, I can see people like, like there's someone on here that <clears throat> the last person that subscribed to me, it says they've subscribed 20 hours ago, 21 hours ago, one day ago, one day ago. Um, those DTAC gloves, the brand new DTAC gloves, those were at, um, those were at um, Dick Sports. Let me let this cat out. He's freaking out. Get out of here. That's a turd. Um, yeah, definitely let us know how that how that goes. Uh, BM Golden Goblin says, I've been here for a while since you reviewed, so it might be. Yeah, it's probably too far for me to go back. Um, but, man, I'm looking at, like, I've had a ton of people subscribe here recently. 
right now my subscriber count is 5,527 subscribers. So whenever we did, I guess the, um, whenever we did the, what am I trying to think of the, uh, the 5,000 subscriber, I mean, that was only a few months ago and we're, we're almost to 6,000. So I would say it won't take us long to get there. So that'll be awesome. Uh, hopefully we can hopefully we can get some more uh, subscribers like I like I said uh, it's always good to get more people in here and get people talking about what we do uh, so I'm very excited uh, for that um, so yeah we're gonna let's see I still left a few of the number stickers in here yeah just everything standard it's nothing special with the visor uh, you know you got your number stickers and your and your all your different colors it's got step-by-step -step instructions on how to do this. It's just right here on how to customize your team colors. So um, let's go ahead and see what you guys want to do, okay, since a few of you are watching here. Um, so I've got the helmet. I've got some visor clips. I've got a couple boxes of them here. I don't know what else here. Let's see. So I've got just here's the white ones I had that I painted. Can you tell they're painted? Maybe. Let's see if they'll focus in. I wish I would have got some of the green gridiron uh, white ones. I tried to spray paint one of these. I can't really tell which one I tried to spray paint. It didn't work right. Um, they just need to be touched up again. Um, you know, I've not, I've not done a video on a shock visor. I've not actually seen one in person. So I don't feel like I can give a good kind of comparison between both. I mean, I would recommend Under Armour because that's all I've used. But I think if I got a shock visor, I think I would like it. I, I like what a lot of the, the others have. So I feel like I would... I'd probably be good for any of them. Um, so I'm not, I don't really feel like I, I don't know which one. I honestly, I don't know which one I'd prefer. I think, I think everybody is going to probably say shock uh, just from the sheer amount of just how much, you know, people like their visors. So that's, that's what I would say, honestly. Uh, so let's, let's go through some of these here. So I've got a couple. I've got, I've got basically all the Under Armour clips except blue and pink. I've got red. Let's see what red looks like with this visor. You know what I thought would be cool? If you get, because uh, the visor clips, I've seen them pretty cheap. If you go to like to Academy and stuff. But I was thinking like on this visor, since it'd be red, white, and blue, you could do um like customize they put one side blue one side red i don't know it's just just a thought or idea uh i'm going to seven on seven camp tomorrow i'm a center and coach wants me to go for snapping that's a good idea i would go i always went to seven on seven uh i did a lot of seven on seven my senior year we weren't bad um but we uh i always went I wanted, like, I, I loved it. Like, I, I just snapped the whole time. Like, I didn't run a single route. I, I just snapped the whole lot of fun. Um, but I did the, uh, also, like, we play linebacker, and I didn't, I never played linebacker. So, I hit. It was a fun experience. Like, I, I, um, have you tried getting sponsorships with any of the sports equipment brands like Shot Green Trip? No, I've not. Um, I've got over the years um, Mogo mouth guards. They sent me mouth guards about probably, well. and then here recently, um, oh gosh, what are they? Grip Boost. Grip Boost got a hold of me. Uh, and, and I reviewed some of their stuff, but yeah, I don't, I don't talk. To, I, I just don't 
nobody, I mean, nobody's reached out. So I assume, you know, I mean, I, I, if I ask, I might, but I just feel like I don't have, I don't feel like I have enough, you, I don't feel like I have enough subscribers to be like recommended for any of that. So if we do ever do that, we just have to keep slowly growing our channel. Um, Devin Perez says, hey, I got a quick question. I'm switching schools this year and wanting to play football again. You try to make varsity this time. What is your advice? Um, so I guess my first question would be, are you switching because you're not getting to play or you're switching schools for some other reason and want to play football again? Um, lift. Ah, uh, well, for how much, like as far as time, I lift mm, four to five times a week. Uh, and I, I do leg press, incline, uh, lat pull downs. I mean, I, I'm, I max myself on all that kind of stuff, but uh, that's, I mean, that's what I really do. Um, I've really been you know, doing a lot of fun stuff like So, what do you think about this? Something, something subtle to it. Um, so, yeah. I gotta find, let's see. I don't know where those little peanuts went. Let me dig in here and get some of these together. This visor. Um, so, if y'all will wait just a second, we're I'm right here, so I'm gonna kind of just uh, I'm gonna kind of just make sure. All right, I think I'm live, I hope. All right, anyway, I gotta set up the camera here. Okay, so hope everybody can see me here. Uh, let's adjust a little. Okay, so here's our face mask. All right, so make sure I'm still making. I'm not sure. Can y'all hear me? Can y'all hear me on here? Okay. Okay. So, um, I guess my Devin would be uh, to to go talk, go talk with the local coaches um, that wherever whatever town you're uh, going to, if they've got a football team, uh, go go find that that program that's near you. Uh, and make sure to try to, you obviously want to enroll in that school. Um, but as far as getting in there, um, I would, the best part, the best advice I would have to give you would be if you show up uh, and, and claim that you want to play football, uh, you definitely want to uh, show the coaches that you want to be there. So that would be my first bit of advice is to go in, find the program that you need to be in. Uh, and then that you want to, want to be in, want to play for, uh, and so on, uh, and then go from there and just make sure, like, to go in and work hard. You know, that's 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 what I can tell you is the best is the best advice I can give you on that. Um, so we've got the visor sort of in here. Don't want to wedge it in there too bad, but. All right. It's always kind of hard to put it on these uh,
where'd you get the USA visor from? Flag visor. Flag visor came from uh, Ross. Uh, I've seen this in stores and actually two stores. And um, I was like super excited when this, when I saw this, I was like, this is like one of the giveaway items that we're doing. So I was super stoked to see this. Let's see original clips for this. So we'll go ahead and put this guy on here. Hopefully that helped answer your question. Um, if you have any more questions, definitely just let us know. Um, but yeah, uh, I'm super excited uh, to do this. Like I said, you guys need to mark your calendars uh, for June 30th. We are going to give away this visor, uh, June 30th, and that's going to be kind of our big monthly live stream. Um, yeah, um, Golden Goblin, I would definitely – um, I've seen it at Hibbit Sports. I don't know if you have a Hibbit Sports in your area, but this is a, a pretty cool visor, uh, and I would definitely recommend it um, just by the the sheer amount of coolness uh, that this has because it's just so awesome looking. Uh, so, all right, so I've got to put the – I'm going to put this to the side for a second, and I've got to get some equipment out of here. Yeah, but we are going to give it away. Um, we are going to give it away here in the end of June, the very last day of June. We're going to give it away. And just so you guys know, you can use like shut face guard. Um, you can use their face guard, like not their clips, obviously. Um, but they're like their screws and T-hooks, T-nuts. Um, you can use those on there. Your school doesn't allow for visors, sadly. That's unfortunate because visors are, they're the, they're pretty cool. I don't like when people say you can't wear visors. Like I, if you want to wear a visor, like go for it, man. I, I've been at schools where they were, you know, like use, it's usually the head coach that doesn't allow it. Um, I don't care, honestly, like, and that's just, that's my personal philosophy behind it. I just don't care. Um, and it's not that I don't care what you wear, but I'm just like, if, if, if a kid wants to wear, if a kid wants to wear something and puts money into buying it, then you should, you should let them, because if they spend 50 or $60 on the silly thing, you should be able to use it. And it's just, that's just what it's about, but all right, so here's our helmet, and we're going to go ahead, line the face mask up here, get our clips put on. So I haven't been able to post too many videos here lately. Uh, I was in a, I was at a school conference here. Um, a few days ago and have, have been uh, kind of busy, but I tried to post what I could. Um, uh, let's see. Let's answer Devin's question here. Uh, he says, thanks. Another question. I'm D tackle and need some new gloves and cleats. What would you recommend? Um, oh gosh, lost the, lost the screw. Okay. Um, I would probably recommend, uh, as far as gloves, the these are kind of expensive, but the there are other there are there are other alternatives out there, and I can show you. Um, let me pull up something here. I want to see what Battle has because Battle has Lyman gloves, but they're they're not bad. Uh, I don't. I want to say they're like forty dollars. I may be wrong. Yeah, they're forty-four dollars. Uh, I would say the bat, like as far and, I, and I've never tried these, so 
I wouldn't be able to say for sure if they're um, if they're what you need, but these uh, Lyman adult football gloves. Um, let me show you again here. So I feel like they'd be a solid glove. They got some padding here on the palms. It's going to be kind of a leathery texture on the fingers. Should be a solid glove. They got, you know, uh, padding all throughout the back of the hand, which is what you need. Good wrist strap, it looks like. Good solid wrist straps because uh, you got to have that for alignment to have good wrist support. So uh, I think that would be the best one. And then as far as cleats go, um, some of the Adidas freak cleats uh, would be a good bet. Um, there's there's a lot of there's a lot of Lyman style cleats out there. Um, the Von Miller cleats. I don't know if any of you guys have seen the Von Miller cleats, but those would also be a good. They're pretty affordable for what they are. Uh, I would definitely probably recommend those. Uh, honestly, I got to look at those going to Dick Sports the other. I got oh gosh, really struggling to get this on. <laughs> um, let me try to adjust this so I can get it on. I'm, normally, I wouldn't work on this table. I don't trust. I'm being very gentle with the table because it's just um, if everything goes flying here in a minute, just know that the, the cameras fell down and the computer and, and all that. But hopefully that doesn't happen. But I'm trying to be gentle. Hardest thing is just getting it set. Okay, I've got the I've got the first screw set. Sorry about that. I really just I was really struggling to get that one set, and I just had to put it in my lap and really just hold on to it. Um, which battle gloves did you have? I'm curious to know which ones. Um, and, and the cutters has like I said, cutters has uh, good ones too. Uh, kind of like uh, Gavin said there. Um, I've not tried any of the Cutters Lyman gloves uh, ever. I would love to. Cutters, if you could hook me up with some gloves, that'd be great. Um, <laughs> but yeah, that's uh, then having a 16. Good night, man. You got a size 16. Uh, I wear a size 14. Uh, man, if I, I would try as far as Lyman cleats go let me look at east bay real quick um i'll show you here what we're looking at here's the visor uh here's the helmet and all that i'll show you guys here what comes to mind for me as far as like uh cleats that'll let me just uh let me just look at cleats and then um, I can, you can search cleats by size. Uh, you should be able to. Men's, they have, uh, they have 200 cleats in size 15, or excuse me, size 16. Uh, so, So like, I mean, uh, let me share my screen again and show you. So 
they've got several cleats here in size 16. Uh, you just need to go to cleats, uh, click on men's, go to 16, and you can see all of these here. <clears throat> as far as um, I kind of started on the lower end, the Nike Four Savage Sharks are going to be a solid lineman cleat. You're going to have a top strap up here that will help um, help with adjusting uh, kind of the ankle strap on there. Four Savage Shark would be a good one there at $60 nearly. Um, Menace Varsity uh, is a solid one. They have all the NFL colors in this as well. It looks like these are all in um, – I just looked through all these. That's, that's how I search for size 14. And all this, uh, Nike Four Savage Pros, those are on sale for 89 They've got the Freak Carbon Lows. Uh, let me go to the next page and see if they've got the mids in those. Uh, I saw these cleats the other day in stores. These were actually just 30 bucks in stores. I found them at a Ross. Um, they've got the Freak Carbon Mids. Uh, they've got that one's in a 16 in blue. They've got them in black. Um, they've got a lot here in a 16. That's really surprising that they have so much. Um, but yeah, man, I would just search them like that. Uh, and you can even, and even the X carbon highs would be a, would be a great cleat as well. Uh, but definitely if you got any questions on those, let me know. Um, I'm going to do the last part of this install right here and put the, um, put the quick release clips on. That'll be my last part here. As far as doing that, then I'll show you guys what it looks like uh, with the finished product. Never done anything like this over a live stream. Uh, we've done a, we've done a lot of things on the live streams, but never a helmet build. Uh, so I thought that was something neat for today. Just show you guys a little quick helmet build here. I don't have a quick release tool. That's at school. So I just use uh, just use a you can use anything. I mean you can use a I've used a pen before to get it off. There we go. And the final pin to be set. And there we go. All right, let me get the camera set back up over here. All right, we're back. And here's our helmet. All set and ready to go. Visor's on. Probably adjust that clip a little more. I didn't want to get it on there too tight. But uh, let's go ahead and try this sucker on. Oh, yeah. That's a cool visor to look through. So now we're just going to do the live stream like this. <laughs> uh, am I a couch? Coach? <laughs> yes, I'm a coach. Um, let's see. BM Golden Goblin says it was the Battle Hybrid. The hybrid gloves, I've not heard anything out of those, and I am testing the ultra stick gloves, so that'll be something that I've got to test too, just to see how the the grip goes. I am a coach, so y'all didn't know. Most people most people do know that, um, but some people don't. Yes, coach in high school, defensive coordinator. It's kind of weird for me to do videos like this, but I've been doing them forever. Been doing these videos forever. But yeah, this is a like I love the blue tint. Like I think that's my favorite part of the visor is just the blue tint. And the fact that you can't see the eyes is just so cool. I do not own a speed flex, even though I've had them in my videos before. I uh, don't actually own one yet. That's why we do stuff like Patreon. Uh, so I can raise money so I can get stuff like that. And hopefully one day uh, we can have enough so we can have a fund and uh, hopefully get a speed flex one day for the channel. I think that'd be a great, great thing for us. 
Um, do any of your players know about your channel? Uh, actually, in the two schools that I've worked at, um, both times players have approached me and said they found my channel. Uh, but yes, my players do know about my channel. And it just goes to show like, like it blows my mind that like, you know, I could have 5,000 people subscribe and more, but you know, I've had millions, I have like in total upload views, I have well over 2 million total upload views on all my videos. So I mean, 2 million people, you know, if we're looking at just the United States, 2 million people, I mean, that's, that's like, I'm just, I got to do the math on that. Here's my calculator. Uh, so if there's 300, 300 million people in the United States, more, let's see, is that 300 mil? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 300 mil. You divide that by my 2 million people that have seen me. Hmm, that doesn't make sense. Anyway, um, a lot of people, um, a lot of people have seen my stuff. Um, I got a quest, saw a question on here. Do I have any lineman workouts? Actually, I do. Um, it's more of an offensive lineman workout, but I mean, it's a it's a lineman workout. Um, and it is on, um, I believe right now I could, I could share it with you. Um, it is, it, that is something that's a part of, um, I want to say I did a live stream. Let me, let me just go ahead and back up. Cause I don't think it's posted to Patreon yet, but I have a, um, I've got a, I've got some kind of like, it's like a spring break workout. If you go back through my older videos, Devin, you go back and find a uh, spring break workout. That's going to be, uh, it was a workout that I actually gave my players uh, to do over spring break, my linemen. Uh, and they did it, filmed what they were doing. Uh, but that, that was a, that's what I've got. And I, and I shared that on there. So you can have, uh, you can, you can use that, of course. But, um, but yeah, um, next week, next week, uh, we have some announcements coming up next week. Uh, we will live stream probably pretty briefly, um, next Friday. Uh, here's the thing about next Friday. And if we don't do a live stream, just know that, um, uh, you, you'll understand why we, me and Amber are getting married, uh, next Saturday. So uh, we're going to be getting married and going on a honeymoon for a few days. So there probably won't be uh, any videos. I'm going to almost say there's not going to be any videos. So um, I don't know what kind of the, I have some videos that I've got to film for this week. Um, so that'll be something I'm going to be working on. But we're going to be pretty busy over the next few days um, getting a lot of stuff done. But uh, ultimately, this should be. Uh, pretty much a pretty much a given, but you know we'll we'll try to. I want to have a shoulder pad video for this week. Expect a, a new expect a new video tomorrow. Um, I kind of I feel like I need to upload a couple extras just because I've kind of uh, left behind and didn't get everything I want uploaded. Uh, thank you. You guys are uh, have definitely seen us go through. Um, you know, not really seeing us go through anything, but yeah, I mean, you know, you guys have seen Amber for well over a year now. Uh, we've known each other for almost, this will be, we've been together for two years. Um, but yeah, I've got some videos to still come out. I need to do another top five video, so I'll be working on that um, here soon. I've got, uh, I uploaded the Adidas gloves. Hopefully you guys liked uh, the, the Adidas gloves. Um, the Adidas Admoji gloves. Uh, I was okay, so I went to Dick Sporting Goods the other day, and and I saw all their Admoji gloves. Like they had the black and grays, they had the white on whites with the gray, and then they had the Snoop, uh, they had the Snoop gloves. Those those look so awesome. Uh, <laughs> they they do cost like you know like five five or ten dollars more, but yeah, those are those are just some sick gloves. 
Uh, definitely check out Dick Sporting Goods if you want like some white gloves because they got like all the styles in white. Um, we're doing our live stream. Um, I didn't do a way back Wednesday and I would do need to film my way back Wednesday for you guys. So hopefully I can get that out this week. My way back Wednesday should have been uploaded Wednesday, but I was getting back late um, from a, a teaching conference. So I wasn't able to uh, get back in time to do that. Um, Gavin says, I have the Snoop cleats. Somebody was, I uh, guess a spoo -foo killer was on Discord today and he was showing all the different uh, Admoji cleats. They were the money cleats. Um, like this is this, I actually, so they're like the coolest thing. All right, so I have to. I forgot to go grab this, and I'll go get it here in a little bit. But this is the like a few years ago. This shirt came out with like I've got like a Snoop Dogg shirt that's Adidas that says "Mind on my money, money on my mind." And I was like, I wore that shirt yesterday, and like I can't remember where I, people thought that shirt was cool. Um, this one, it kind of matches the. I've got like a sleeve out there, and now I got to find the Adidas socks uh, that go with it. Um, there's some Adidas like uh, digital print socks that go with it. I'm going to be right back and go get this sleeve. So, yeah, check this out. Courtney Logan's in here. He says, hey, uh, picked this up the other day. Uh, and it was actually just like, I believe this came out. I'm trying to look for a date on when this was created. But this is a pretty cool little sleeve, compression arm sleeve. Um, can't remember what year it came out. Um, but yeah, it's, this was a cool little sleeve I found and it'll match this shirt obviously, but here's, here's kind of, it's like, uh, the Snoop sleeve. Pretty cool. So, so yeah, that was a cool little pickup I had the other day. Um, we'll be doing a live, uh, if we, if we do live stream next, next Friday, hopefully we can. Um, we'll try to do like a little small giveaway, hopefully, uh, and do something like that. Uh, but like I said, mark your calendars for June 30th. Um, June 30th, we will give away the Under Armour flag visor. Here it is. In all its glory. Put it on one more time. It's pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. I like it. I like it a lot. You can really can't see through it, but um, all right. So like the cleats that came with the sweatband, like those, I want those. They're so like those were out like a few years ago, and those I can't remember if they came out last year or the year before. Like I'm I'm really I'm really struggling to remember the when all that stuff came out, but the cleats with the sweatband. And it's like, um, but yeah, I know what you're talking about. It looks just like this. Let me pull this out here. It kind of has, kind of looks like that. It's like a little gold white sweatband. It says 10,000 on it. That's so like, that's, that's pretty awesome. Um, I would love to find a pair of size 14s in those and rock those. That'd be so sweet. That'd be so sick. Um, so yeah, I've got the money sleeve. I want to get the socks that match these two because I think after that I'll have all the all the stuff that goes with these except for the cleats and the gloves gosh forgot about the gloves they had like they had like a whole setup a few years ago of like all this stuff but I can see where some of that gets old but I, I wore this shirt like every week I love this speed rich shirt it's so awesome uh, so hopefully I can find that uh, other news um, so if you guys have not heard of this thing called sideline swap, okay, I want to talk, I want to talk to you guys about sideline swap. I talked about this last week. Um, sideline swap is kind of like an eBay of sorts, but for sports gear. And so like you log on to sideline swap and this is not sponsored or nothing. I'm not doing this like for anything, 
like this is for me like i'm gonna try to like sell some of the gear that i have lying around i know you can't see that very well maybe now uh but this is the silent swipe silent swap at first i thought it was just for baseball because i saw a lot of like baseball gloves this was being advertised on instagram for me and then i scrolled down i was like football all right we're gonna look at football stuff and then so like they've got all kind of stuff sports stars on here sports stars selling stuff um yeah they've got they have tons of stuff like a lot of people ask me about those bolt pads. Somebody's selling those on there for $50, okay? Like, I wish people wouldn't ask me about them because, like, you can go find them. Um, somebody's selling football stuff, $1,000. What is all this? Uh, it's just, like, a lot, of, a lot of stuff. Huh. Interesting. But, yeah, they got so much on here. Like, I'm trying to find something that... There's stuff on here posted all the time, so I'm curious to know how how well I could sell something. Uh, and you can always like like I said, you can like they got an owner advisor on here, um, twenty bucks. I'm wanting to get on here and post up some of my stuff. So if you guys go searching for me, um, I'm just um, Mr. Football. Just type in Mr. Football, you'll find my stuff. If you guys go to my Discord. Uh, I'll let you guys know as soon as as soon as stuff comes out. Uh, I'll let you know what's posted on there if you're interested in any of that stuff. So, so yeah, we're gonna be on here. I'm trying to, you know, I, I usually I usually just kind of search on here and look for certain things, but I'm just kind of scrolling through the main stuff because, like, here lately I've not had a whole lot of luck selling on eBay. Cause I'm like, I'm like selling good football stuff on eBay, but like nobody's buying it. So I don't know if what's going on with eBay. I don't know if it's just kind of dead right now. Nobody's it's called sideline swap. Sideline swap is basically, uh, it's just like an, it's like an eBay. You don't bid. So like, I don't know if I wanted to, let's just say they've got an Under Armour clear visor. Okay. It's 20 bucks. I can go on here and I can buy that now. I can make an offer on that and don't be one of those people. <laughs> don't be one of those people that um, goes on there. And like, I hate this. All right. When somebody goes on there and they like offer you two bucks or something, I'm just like, you're already out. Like I'm not, I'm not selling something for $2. And like, I know that like people, like I'm not going to be low balled. Like that's just how, it, um, but it's super easy to load your stuff on here. And whenever, if you do sell something, like they will print you a shipping label right then and there. So Logan, Courtney Logan says, my cleats is dirty. Um, cleats are dirty. Um, best way to clean your cleats uh, would be just to get a little toothbrush, use an old toothbrush and just scrub those suckers clean. Uh, you might have to use a little soap if there's like stains in them, but you don't have to do anything like detergent or anything. Like it's pretty simple to get, get some stains out of the cleats and get them out. And then um, you could even, I'm not even trying anything like get, get the can of spray. I like to do this, shake it. See that? <laughs> uh, I like to do that anyway. Uh, but yeah, I'm just, I'm going to get, I'm going to get some stuff uploaded to silent swap tonight. Hopefully, uh, because I'm kind of probably be getting off here soon guys. So I can start to work on some videos. Uh, for you guys, so because we've not had a whole lot to talk about, but I did want to show you just the final product here. If you guys haven't seen, uh, we installed this Under Armour um, flag visor on here, put some custom clips on it, show you like that. Uh, so, yeah, um, very excited. Hopefully, uh, we can do something like this again. Like I said, mark your calendars. For June 30th, we'll be giving that item away. Uh, what do you guys want to see for July? Um, let, me, let me get a drink of water here. I'm getting out of breath. So in July, I'm going to be giving away a battle backplate. 
Uh, what I want to give away one of the chrome back plates. Uh, which which one of those you want to see? Um, you know, if we just wanted to do like gold or silver, those colors are pretty generic. Um, but I am thinking about getting one of the one of the other ones too. So I don't know. We'll probably go with we'll probably go with gold to be honest. Um, we'll try to we'll try to do that. So that's that's kind of my thoughts. They also had like a chrome flag one too. Um, so we'll we'll definitely get into that as well. Anthony says blue. I, I'm open to all colors, so uh, we'll kind of we'll probably talk about that eventually. Um, because I'll you know it just depends. Like if we have a great if we have a great showing of um, of people coming through um, Patreon and and all that we can get and, and since finding that visor for you know like 16 under 20 dollars basically and it was like a 64 dollar visor that opens us up to do so much more so you know that's that's what that's what's exciting about this is we can do so much more for what we for what we originally had and um thinking about getting this face mask for the uh, shut vengeance uh, a few of my when I coached a youth team, I had a few players have that visor or, the, or not the visor, but the face mask. And it was pretty cool. Uh, they looked, looked pretty awesome in it. So um, we'll definitely be looking at that, but they definitely check out silent swap. I'll be putting some of my stuff on there um, and, and showing that. So hopefully you guys will uh, be able to check that out. Um, but I want to go ahead and get off here guys. I want to thank you <clears throat> so much for, uh, joining in on this live stream tonight uh as always uh thank you so much for watching uh like i said stay tuned for all the videos we're coming out with this week uh we've got quite a bit uh got quite a bit going on next week but there will be some videos for you guys to check out uh as we're going through this but definitely want to say thank you thank you for watching uh stay stay subscribed check me out on patreon discord instagram all that good stuff and now sideline swap. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and we will see you next time.